Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have been told their brand is on life support in the United States, while their popularity has plummeted and the polling on the couple is terrible. The Sussexes have faced a backlash from many over recent months following several criticisms and claims they have made against the royal family. In December, Meghan and Harry starred in their own documentary series on Netflix and, just weeks later, the prince released his memoir Spare, which saw him take aim at the likes of King Charles, Prince William, Princess Kate, and Camilla, Queen Consort. Sky News Australia host Rita Banai was speaking to Kenzie Schofield on her show, with the royal expert warning the couple's brand is facing a critical period. Ms. Banai said, We do know that their popularity has plummeted. The polling on the pair is terrible, for Prince Harry but particularly for Duchess Meghan because she is polling less than Prince Andrew, and that takes some doing. Obviously they want to repair their reputation, they want to have that standing that they once had. How will they achieve that? They must have some plans in place. They wouldn't just be sitting back and accepting this. Get the latest royal news straight to your phone by joining our WhatsApp community. Ms. Schofield replied, I do think they are going to struggle to rebrand. She added, obviously they have to reinvent themselves, whether it's the TIG launching or Prince Harry becoming the face of some sort of mental health campaign. They have to change the direction of their brand because it is on life support here in the United States. Harry and Meghan have kept a relatively low profile since the launch of the Duke of Sussex tell-all memoir in January. Earlier this month, Buckingham Palace confirmed he will attend the coronation of King Charles III at Westminster Abbey on May 6, but that Meghan would remain at home in California. Prince Archie's fourth birthday falls on the same day as the coronation, and it has been speculated Harry could make a flying visit to the UK so he could return home in time to celebrate his son's special day with him. Don't miss! King Charles urged to give interview to stop Meghan stealing spotlight, report, Prince Harry and Meghan's touching gesture to staff at basketball game, pictures, Meghan and Harry dominating the agenda as Charles releases new photo, reaction, but one marketing expert believes Harry attendance at the coronation could go a long way to boosting their brand. When asked about how Harry attending his father's coronation might affect the Sussex brand, Pauline McLaren, professor of marketing and consumer research at Royal Holloway University in London, told Express. Co.uk, had they not come at all, it would have been very difficult for their brand. Their whole brand is based on them being royals and although they have been criticizing the royals, they also still want to keep their royal titles, they want their children to have them and they are not saying they want to finish with royalty. That being said, they are practically nothing without maintaining their royal connections. The expert continued, if they both go. They both risk looking very foolish if they are met with a lot of hostility and that would be very bad for their brand. On the other hand, if they don't go at all, they are cutting off from the royals even though they still have their titles. They really do need to top up their royal tinsel and glamour. This is the ideal compromise, Harry comes and they are still reinforcing their importance in terms of him being the son of the king. They are reinforcing their royal connections but limiting their reputational damage through the hostility they will face.